What is up, Fit Pros? I want to welcome you to another episode of the Fit Pro Business Show. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today is all about marketing, sales, and lead generation. Today, I'm going to be talking about how you can take your business to the next level and some tools that you can use to take your business to the next level. If we're just meeting for the first time, my name is Andy Salazar. I'm your In the Trenches fitness business coach and mentor, giving you all the latest marketing, sales, lead generation, and business systems that are working for me and other fitness business owners to help us grow our business, increase our income, and have a greater impact on our communities. So if you are a purpose-driven fitness business owner that wants to grow your income and impact more lives, then this is the show for you. If you're watching via YouTube, hit that subscribe button. Also get notifications via the bell. If you are listening to this podcast via, listening to this audio via podcast, I appreciate you guys so much. Please hit that subscribe button and also come back and leave me a review so other people can find this show and it can reach more people. So today, what I want to talk about is how you can take your business to the next level. So I like to start the show with giving off some quotes, and I want to give you guys one of my favorite quotes of all time, and it's by Arthur Ashe, and it's, start where you are, use what you have, and do what you can. That's a quote by Arthur Ashe, and I just love this quote so much because it, 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 strip, it, strip down, it strips you down to the core, like, start where you are. Don't worry about where you aren't right now or where you want to be. Start where you are, use the tools and the, what you have available to you right now, and do what you can. That's a quote by Arthur Ashe. It's very powerful. The other quote I like is, if you want to be happy, set a goal that commands your thoughts, liberates your energies, and inspires your hopes. That's by Andrew Carnegie. And today, what I wanted to talk about with taking your business to the next level is just to start where you are and do what you can. Know your numbers for what goals you want to target, what you have to have as far as clientele, as far as where your overhead needs to be so that you can reach your big goals, set big goals and map out a plan to achieve them. That's how you're going to take your business to the next level. So let's dive right in. So if you want to take your business to the next level, you have to start where you are, use what you have and do what you can have a no excuses attitude. I want to encourage you to start taking action towards your goals and not comparing yourself to others. So sometimes in this industry, we start seeing guys on Facebook or other people that we follow, and they look like they're doing so well, and we start comparing ourselves to where they're at or where we're at right now and how we're not where we're supposed to be. I want you guys to just sit back, take a deep breath, appreciate where you're at in this journey right now, and keep taking positive steps towards your goal. That is the fastest way that you can get discouraged with yourself and with where your business is right now is by comparing yourself to others. It's okay to look up to others and try to emulate the things that they're doing and because success leaves clues, right? But you also need to embrace where you're at right now and keep pushing towards your greatness. What is the next step you want to take to move your business to the next level? Not comparing yourself to somebody else or what they're doing and beating yourself up because you're not where you think you should be at this current moment in time. That's what I've been guilty of in the past where like I've been in this industry for 13 years. I should be doing this or I should be doing that. No, embrace where I am. Be happy with the value that I'm providing to my clients, the value that I'm providing to um, my industry and embrace it and be happy with it and stop comparing myself to others and keep striving for what goals I have set for myself. And I want you to encourage you guys to do the same things thing for yourselves. So number one, start where you are, use what you have and do what you can. I want to encourage you to start taking action towards your goals and stop comparing yourself to others. The other thing that's really important when you're trying to take your business to the next level is you need to know your numbers. You need to dial in on how many clients you need to have in order to reach your income goals. How many prospects do you need to get in the door every month to hit your new start goals? What is your overhead right now? How, could you, how can you minimize your overhead so you can maximize the amount of money that you bring home? This is so important when you're running a business is to pay attention to your numbers because what happens when we don't pay attention to our numbers, maybe our um, expenses increase, but our clientele doesn't increase. And what happens is that the less income that you're bringing or you bring in a staff member that takes away from your income because that's somebody that you have to start paying now, but you haven't increased your clientele. So remember, when you're running a business, you have to focus on the numbers. You can't bury your head in the sand and not pay attention to the numbers in your business. 
the amount of automatic drafts you have coming out, coming, coming in every month. What are your projected revenues for the month? What, when are your expenses going out? When are your, when is your invoices coming back in? So these are all things that you need to know when you're running a business, if you want to take your business to the next level. And if you don't pay attention, can get away from you very quickly. And trust me from experience, this is something that you have to stay on top of. And I've talked about it in the past is you have to have some sort of management software, bookkeeping software that you utilize. I personally use a service that I recommend highly. And that is the service that I recommend is PT Minder. And they've worked fantastic for me. I highly recommend you looking them up. So the next thing you need to know to take your business to the next level is to set big goals that inspire you and motivate you to take action. Don't set these little goals that you know that you can achieve. Set big goals that you are going to keep striving for. And the reason, write down the reason why you want to strive for these goals, why you're setting to reach these goals and what's going to motivate you to keep taking action toward these goals. Don't set goals that you know you're going to reach because that's not going to push you to take your business to the next level. Now, if you set a goal to make $100,000, but you already know that you can be there and that you're, you're almost there, set a goal for $250,000 and motivate yourself to take action towards that goal on a daily basis and map out a plan on how you're going to achieve it. That's step number three to taking your business to the next level. Set big goals that inspire you and motivate you to take action. Don't set goals that you know that you can achieve. Set big goals, 10x goals like Grant Cardone talks about all the time that inspire you to keep taking action, keep moving forward, not just from an income perspective, but the amount of lives that you can impact, the amount of impact you can have on your community when you increase the amount of people that you can serve. So set big goals that inspire you and motivate you to take action. And step number four to taking your business to the next level is you got to have a plan. And one of the simplest goal setting plans that I've learned, and and this is again through one of my coaches, Eric Lotham teaches this, is set a goal, put a strategy in motion to reach that goal, and then start taking action. That's GSA, goal, strategy, action. So set a goal, map out a strategy that's going to help you achieve that goal. So if that goal is an income goal, What's the strategy is going to get you to that goal? What sort of marketing? What, how many leads? How many people do you have to have to meet, to meet that goal? And then start taking action daily to reach that goal. Goal, strategy, action. The simplest goal setting process that you can utilize. Goal, strategy, action. That's the GSA goal setting example. I also found this mind map software that is really cool to plug everything in. And you can mind map exactly how you're going to reach your specific goal mindup.com it's mindmup.com m-i-n-d-m-u-p.com and you can actually mind map exactly how you're going to reach your goals whether that's your target income goal and you mind map off of, off of that what t- sort of services and income that you can get to reach that goal and see it visually and you can print that out and look at it daily that's going to help inspire you to take action I know that you guys can do this. I know that you guys can take your businesses to the next level and that you guys have what it takes. I'm here for you. Schedule that free business breakthrough if you're feeling stuck in your business, not sure sure what actions you need to take or if you need help with your sales process or lead generation, I'm here for you. Reach out to me. You can schedule that at fitprobusiness.com forward slash breakthrough. If you're not comfortable with going to that website and scheduling it directly, feel free to text me directly. 559-280-5487. Send me a text saying you'd like to set up a free business breakthrough session and I will hop on the phone with you. We'll sit down and we'll dive into your business and I'll help you get unstuck with your business, figure out where you're at and also help you take your business to the next level. I'm here for you guys. Reach out to me. Remember time plus consistency is going to equal results. And I know that you guys can do this, that you can take your businesses to the next level. Again, reach out to me at fitprobusiness.com forward slash breakthrough. I appreciate you guys. Tune into the next show Monday, as well as I'll be doing my In the Trenches fitness business show on Thursday. If you haven't got on that schedule yet and you are an In the Trenches fitness business owner that wants to be interviewed about where you're at in your business, how you got started in the fitness industry, and inspire other fitness business owners or or uh, business owners that are thinking about coming into this industry and want to start their own personal training businesses, Go to that same website, fitprobusiness.com forward slash breakthrough and set up a 
in the trenches fitness business interview. Thanks a lot. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a good one.